All right, tip number three is gonna be multi-cursor. Okay, so we've added a class to this group of divs that I've got randomly in here, but let's say I need to add another class. Okay, what I can do is I, say I wanna add a class to all of them. Okay, it uh, can be tough, so I can put multiple cursors. So what I can do is hold down the Alt key or the Option key on a Mac, okay, and I can drag across all three of these. And look, I got loads of cursors. I can put another class, and this might be my, um, I can't remember what any classes. I've got a bold class. Okay, so you can just have the cursors going. Now, we've done that in our tutorial series, great. But let's say we wanna do it in kind of random places. That's great when they're all, because you can alt drag across. But let's say I need one there, but also I need to add it here as well. Okay, alt doesn't work. Okay, you need to alt drag it. So what you can do is start here, hold down command, and I wanna put one in there. And I wanna put one there. So I'm adding classes in all these places. Can you see my cursors? One there, one there, one there, all flashing. I can say, um, other class. I don't know what this class is called, but. Awesome. Okay, so multi-cursors, but even better when they're not just in one place, you can have them all over the shop. All right, that is the multi-cursor awesome cheat sheet shortcut.